In this video I'm going to show you how you can download an entire website and view it offline. So for this we're going to be using a free program called HTTrack Website Copier. So basically the address is www.httrack.com. I'll put that in the description so you can just click on the link. So once you're on the website just follow the, um, the details, go to the download page and just download the appropriate version for your um, Windows system. So once that's um, installed on your PC, you should see the little icon on the desktop. So we'll just open up HT Track Website Copier. And then we're going to just click the next button. So for here, we, you know, for you know, obviously you're going to download a, a website of your choice. So you can just give it a, um, a project name to say test. Test download. Um, in terms of category, you don't have to enter anything there. Um, the base path is basically where the website um, download files will be stored on your PC. It's a good idea to create a folder for this. So, for example, if you open up your folder and you go to, say, your documents or whatever folder you want to save the website files, right-click on the documents um, area and select new folder and just, again, just call it whatever you want. So I'm just going to call mine test download. So I can close that for the time being. So I want to select my selected um, destination here. So documents and test download. So basically all the website files will now go to that particular folder in my documents. So again, click next. So from here, we want to enter the um, URL of the website you want to download. So I just pick one of my sites here a minute. Okay, so basically you just want to copy the URL from the top um, toolbar and then you want to enter it into the um, web address, so just enter there. So make sure you enter all the HTTP and so on. So then there's some other options that use such an action that allows you to download um, certain parts of the website. Just generally leave it as it is, download web site. So um, yeah, so basically that's all you need to do. So the next step is to click next. Click finish, so you can. You see, there's another few options here you can choose. Again, you don't have to really do anything; just leave it as it is. Click finish, and it will then down, start downloading that entire website you've just chosen. Now, bear in mind, this isn't a quick process. You cannot go around and say download sites such as YouTube or sites which are absolutely massive in size. This is generally for small to medium-sized websites, say ones that are say, less than a couple of gigabytes in size. So bear in mind, this usually takes anything from kind of five minutes to maybe 30 plus minutes, depending on the size of the website you've chosen, so be patient. For now, I'm just going to cancel this as I've already downloaded it. So I'm just going to cancel this and close this and just give you an example. So I downloaded this site earlier. So I'll just go into my documents and show you how it works. I've downloaded it here. So once you go into your folder, you want to select the index page. It will then open in your chosen web browser, the, your default web browser. Then you click on the folder, which is tech in my case. Then you click on the URL. And there it is. It's basically opened that. That's completely offline. So I can now just scroll and read the website. I can click on certain pages. And again, it just shows the entire website in its um, offline form. You know, th this should work pretty smoothly. Don't expect the website you've downloaded to work perfectly, as sometimes there can be kind of small errors depending on the kind of software that the um, person who's made the website's used and so on. But generally it works fine 95% of the time. So that's how you can download an entire website and view it offline with a free program called HT Track Website Download. Thanks for watching.